Before he left for Washington to do the nation's business, Ron Kind was back in La Crosse doing a little personal business, picking up some Wisconsin cheese for swearing in day gifts, and scouting oh, out potential district okay. office space. Yeah. Wow. Hey. These are very nice. Kind won the right to be here while running on the Democratic Party ticket, but Kind seems determined to carve out a niche as a centrist. The Republicans were able to hold on to the majority in the House, but it's a very slim majority. And so coalitions that can work together will really uh, make or break legislation. And that's where the battleground is going to lie. We've talked about different things, and, and it's been interesting how even a couple times when I assumed he would do the traditional Democratic thing, he said, no, that's too Democrat. I'm going to bring this thing to the center, try to do like you did. I'm going to be joining the Democratic Leadership Coalition that's forming right now. It's a, it's a group of moderate Democrats who are very concerned about the, the fiscal crisis that we're facing. It's kind of similar to the lunch bunch that Steve Gunnarsson and a lot of the moderate Republicans have had in place. Local Republicans will take a wait-and-see approach to Kine's bipartisan posturing, and they won't hesitate to hold his feet to the fire. Yes, that we will probably be writing to him, phoning the legislative hotline for any issues that come up that we are in total disagreement with. Any advice for me as I start the uh, congressional career? In addition to balancing left and right, Kind has promised to balance home and work. He plans to make his a uh, commuting job, coming back to Lacrosse and wife Tawny and son Johnny every weekend. But he's the kind of a guy who wants to stay in touch, I know. And I wouldn't be surprised if he finds a way to come home almost every weekend so that he can stay in touch with the people, with those he represents. I think it really is becoming the norm and a necessity. I think it's important for the representatives to maintain those close ties to the district and the people they're representing. Kine says he's anxious to get going in his new job. He says he wants to add civility to public discourse and not lose track of why he's there in the first place. Well, that's easy. It's the main motivating factor for me uh, uh, in this campaign, especially the latter stages of the campaign, was my four-month-old son, Johnny. And uh, if I can, every time I'm casting a vote, thinking about how that's going to affect him and his future and all the children's future, that I don't think I'm going to be able to screw up that, that much if I can keep that focus in mind, that I'm not only doing this uh, for those today, but for future generations, then uh, hopefully that'll steer me in the right course. Terry Bell, News 19.